this is Greg Benson with AgWeb. We're talking to J.C. Hoyt with GrowGrains.com today. We'll first have you tell about the opportunity that you uh, are finding for some producers in Nebraska and possibly western Iowa. So why don't we start there and then we'll get into what Go Grains is. Our uh, data at GoGrain.com is finding that uh, producers in uh, Nebraska uh, that you mentioned and in western Iowa could take advantage of plus 29 cents on old crop soybeans if they go to ADM in Lincoln, Nebraska. Now this opportunity is good till next Friday, the 25th. Uh, as of today, it is at 29 cents over the futures market to be able to take advantage of this. So if any producer out there has any old crop they need to finish up on in those soybean markets, here's an opportunity that hopefully they can take advantage of. And, it, and we think with that kind of opportunity, Greg, even with trucking involved, it's still profitable for them. So they're looking at a, a almost 30 cent, 29 cents uh, at ADM as opposed to maybe across the street Correct, at this point in time, yep. All right, and how are, how are you finding this information? Well, we have uh, 4,000 elevators in our system that we call every day to get their closing bids on, and then when we clean the data into the system, uh, every farmer that goes onto our site of gograin.com is able to find out exactly what his best situation is in a 200-mile radius from where his farm is for these opportunities every day. Uh, now, this opportunity in the soybean market, obviously it's soybean deficit in that part of the region for a reason. However, it's lasting for, you know, two weeks of, of time period for this opportunity to take advantage of, which means they can draw in from a larger radius than when they normally would to give this opportunity to these producers. How far out do you think you can go from this ADM plant in Lincoln to make it worthwhile trucking it that far? Our data shows at GoGrain.com that 200 miles is still a pretty good uh, uh, radius to still take it, the opportunity of that. Once you get beyond the 200 miles, um, it's a little tricky depending if you own your trucks or if you're hiring a truck, depending on that truck rate. But that 200 mile radius is still pretty good. So you're talking about some pretty complicated math here. How do you uh, go about helping farmers figure out whether it is advantageous for them? What do you guys have to offer there? Well, uh, when you go to GoGrain.com, you can get a free demo uh, for 10 days to be able to plug in your farm location and the, the expenses that you're working with on there to be able to uh, have our system automate on a daily basis this solution that I'm talking about. Uh, keep in mind, every producer has a different break-even as well as different expenses involved in their operation. So once you customize it in our system, then the solutions will, will show you exactly the transparency that you're asking here, Greg. So if I'm a, if I'm a farmer, just tell me what do I need to do to get – I mean, this is not a free service, obviously, but what what do you need to do to get signed up for this, and how do you figure out what, what is most advantageous for you? Um, go to our website, gograin.com, sign up for the free demo. Uh, as far as the cost involved, we do give the product of GoGrain out for free as long as you trade with us for $7 a trade on the futures and options side of it. Um, if you uh, After the trial period, if that's not something you want to do, uh, just call us, and we'll have uh, other products that we could possibly work with you on. All right, that's J.C. Hoyt with GoGrains.com. Appreciate your time, J.C. Thank you, Greg.